Hey guys, how's it going? Mr. Bandles1 here. In this video, I'm going to show you how to find and free the White Witch. Now, when you go to Hyberheim and you get into this area, you're going to find an imp called Axis. And when you chat him up and ask him how to free the White Witch from the prison, he will tell you that you can find the stone golem's head and use his mouth to enter a secret tunnel in which, through which you will enter the prison. So, as you can see we are at the secret entrance right now. There's the golem head and there's the hatch. And again it is right here. Now, in order to find this you will actually have to dig out a dirt mound which you can easily spot if you have high enough perception or you can just dig in this spot and it will be the same thing. Since we've done that we can go ahead and walk in. What's this? It looks strange. And then there's gonna be this. It's it's a mirage. Which are a it's ton of mines. It's mirage. That turn you invisible like that My when we me? get near them. And as you can see, if you go with all of your part four party members like that, they will no doubt trigger a mine and then it will cause all mines to explode and some of your party members might die horribly. But either way you can just detonate them all before proceeding or go one by one. It is not is not a big problem. So let's move on. For the purpose of this guide, I didn't even bother raising Scarlet here. It is only she that died. Now here is a storm cloud that we can deactivate by throwing something on that pressure plate. Come on, there you go. And we're gonna go ahead and proceed. There are some more mines over here. But the Roderick should be fine. We can drink some potions, just have him survive. Okay, there goes Jahan. And then we can climb the ladder up to the prison. Looks like I found the prison alright. Now, must be around here we need to dig this mount here, get to the other side, so we can get out because we had a closed gate here. Now there's actually a secret here in this Iron Maiden, we can talk to it, and there's some uh, source magic going on in here where this Iron Maiden has life now. We can chat her up. And basically she's she's miserable and you can destroy it like that and it will throw out the bloodstone which you can then grab. Which is pretty awesome. Then we're gonna have this guy which can talk for some amusing stuff but we're not gonna do that in this guide. Next up we're gonna have a kind of a tricky puzzle which is I believe you can only bypass this puzzle by having someone very good at sneaking or an invisibility potion or the invisibility spell because if we if we try and walk simply walk it doesn't matter if the statues face you or not they will hear you and the trap will trigger and you will die so we're going to go ahead and use some invisibility potions. There's one and there's the second one. Which is really weird because we are still making noise while invisible and yet they can't hear us. It's, it's kind of a, a little bit of a slip there in the puzzle. There we go, you can Actually, use only one guy, then you can teleport everyone at this waypoint portal, and that's fine. I think this deactivates the puzzle or something, not sure. 
you can proceed. And there are two chests here in which you can easily grab. Or I guess that may have deactivated this one. Doesn't really matter. You can go ahead and proceed into the final room where we will meet the White Witch in an in an icy prison. And if we try to free her, there she is, the White Witch, a prisoner in ice. Now to find a means to free her. Indeed, we cannot free her. We cannot just break the ice. In order to find the means to free her from her icy cage, you will actually have to fight King Boreas himself. To get to King Boreas, you will have to cross this bridge here and bypass a portal that is gonna be right here. So in this area, the castle gate. In order to deactivate the portal, you will need a spell scroll. This one right here and it is located in this place. So, we are at the portal right now. We can go ahead and use this spell. And actually, you don't do it that way, you just click on it like that and choose this option. And the portal removes itself. Now, we can go ahead and fight King Boreas. So here we are at this massive forge. Again, it is right here. I even put a marker there, fire forge thing. And all you have to do is grab this wonderful staff, which is a shame that I'm going to do this because it is a quite a powerful staff that you can use before finishing this quest. But anyway, you can go and do this and then the brothers are gonna be free. Then we can chat them up. And we are gonna be able to ask for assistance in freeing the white witch. And he will gladly accept our request. Now all we have to do is go back to the White Witch in Hiberheim prison. Go to her icy cage here. And we will have a shard, a fire rune that we can use in order to summon that fire dude to help us smash the icy cage. So we're gonna go ahead and do just that. I have to wait a moment. There he is. He's gonna be more than glad to use his fire jet and crush this prison for us into tiny little pieces. There we have it. Greetings. And now the quest is pretty much done. We can ask her all sorts of stuff. Just gonna slowly skip through them here. Just in case you wanna read this stuff. Spoilers here, talking about the murder in Sicil and whatnot. And when you're done, she, she's gonna go with zigzags at the end of time, or to the end of time rather. And if we go here now, finding the witch is now completed. So there you have it, guys. I hope this guide was helpful to you. Make sure to like the video, leave a comment, subscribe, thank you for watching, and I shall see you next time. Bye bye.